So here I am um, in the Siberian taiga. It's taken 11 hours of flying from Perth to Dubai, six hours from Dubai to Moscow, seven hours from Moscow to Yakutsk, and then just get the fly out of my ear, and then a further 1,000 kilometers, um, 30 road hour road trip um, to get to the starting point to come into the forest, and then it's um, taken another two hour drive today, half an hour, and then another half hour in along a bush track, and um, a five kilometer walk just to, to get to here. Um, just get rid of those flies. Um, so, and then in the process we've crossed, um, I think we've covered seven time zones now from, since I left Moscow, which is pretty, pretty amazing. Um, very tricky, um, this appears to have been a mix up or miscommunication or something cultural going on, but um, my fixer, the enforcer, thought that um, we only needed to come out here for the afternoon, which I'd, I'd been pretty clear explaining, so there's probably something else going on. Um, one of the challenges um, um, with this is that um, prospecting in Russia is basically outlawed. So anyone that's doing, even just panning for gold, that's that's illegal and everyone's really, really cagey. So there's a big police sting going on at the moment. There's a lot of um, Armenians being pinged and chucked in jail. Um, and uh, the impact of that is um, there's a lot of criminals on the move and everyone's really, really cagey about about being caught and someone like me, a foreigner who they don't know to come in and um, be allowed to do this is, they're taking a big risk because they don't know me. So um, yeah, but it's a bit deflating because there's, there's four prospectors here. Two of them are really, really photogenic. Um, um, when my fixer thought that we only needed to be here for the afternoon, I sort of set him straight um, on that and basically sort of put all my eggs in one basket and said, look, if we can't do it properly, let's go. Um, so I've been given um, permission, oh, the, the, the miners are letting me stay here for about a week, which is good. The enforcer's going to go back and bring some provisions back for me. Um, but the flip side of that is that the um, prospectors don't speak a word of English, so I, I, I'm used to navigating my way around in countries where I don't speak the language, but um, to spend a week with a crew of people that you don't um, that you can't speak their language. I, I'm learning Russian, but I'm still in the, you know, the fairly early stages of learning the language. So that's going to be another challenge as well. Um, yeah, around uh, around here, there's apparently two bears and uh, a bear and two cubs, a mother and two cubs that lives just in around the camp here somewhere. Um, we saw some um, fresh bear tracks coming in. Um, one of the prospectors stopped and pointed them out to me. And everything here is old style. Um, the guys are knocking up a um, a new cabin, uh, probably for winter. I'm not not quite sure. Um, and the, everything's made by hand, so wire and string and wood and um, manually sawing as well. There's no electricity out here as well, so I'm going to have to be careful about battery use and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, an interesting. You know, everyone said that this didn't exist in Russia, and my hunch said that it did. Um, not that it's a big deal, but um, I don't know how many people told me that I wouldn't find what I'd come for. And it's, you know, it feels a bit of vindication to, it feels a bit of vindication to have finally found what I found, which is pretty awesome. So yeah, um, I, one other thing I've, I've been reminded that I, that I don't do, anyone who hasn't subscribed to my YouTube, YouTube channel, um, please do so, Hugh Brand Photography. And um, yeah, I'll be in touch when um, probably probably later today or early tomorrow when I'm starting to get a sense of, of what it is like uh, to be out here but it's as I say it's um, it is really really beautiful the smell of the tiger the you know just the conifer forest it's a real wilderness so I'll be in touch shortly and, and please sign up to that um, YouTube channel thanks a lot